Hey guys, it's the Dutchman's Forum Ass, and welcome back to part 2 of Let's Build a Modern Family House in The Sims 4. So, yeah, last time we started with this build, which starts to get quite some shape already, and I was really happy to see all the feedback regarding this series um yeah just in the comments down below i noticed that there were some people kind of disappointed with the fact that i was back building another modern house this time and i do understand what you meant with that because i know mainly um yeah modern builds have been showing up on my channel recently and therefore i've directly de or immediately decided to build another spanish house for the around the world building series because i realized that i indeed did create very modern uh, very many modern houses recently but still yeah i just felt like building a modern house a modern family house but i promise it will not be too modern don't worry about that and i was really happy to see that there were quite some people happy with uh, another modern house as well but i do realize uh, that you know i should probably add some more variation to it but recently i've um yeah been in the uh, modern style a lot I think I'm going for this color, but I'm not too sure yet for the roof, by the way. Um, otherwise, this was an option. I'm not too sure yet. I think for now, this kind of adds to the idea or the feel of a family house, which is, of course, what this is going to be. Um, so yeah, I was happy to see uh, the feedback and the honest feedback. Um, and yeah, it was not always as uh, polite, but um, yeah, still it wasn't that rude either. And I'm always really happy to get feedback if you kind of bring it in a co uh, constructive way. That's the best way to do, uh, to do it. But of course, if you leave feedback, that's the best thing you can do just to make the channel and the videos more enjoyable. And in that way, you would really help me out as well. So just leaving feedback is an awesome thing to do if you want to help me. Um, so yeah, let me see. I've seen some suggestions, not incredibly many regarding the build, it was just mainly comments saying that you were happy again to see that I was back with another let's build because indeed it had been quite a long time since the last one or the yes simply since the last one or the last time I did one so uh, therefore I'm happy to uh, see that you're you also kind of missed it because I personally missed it as well um, so yeah let me create kind of a patio over here because I feel like that's something that would fit over here um let me delete that and then this could possibly work because i saw that it's not really yeah it's kind of symmetrical over there but not entirely so that kind of sucks but maybe this would work out not too sure though maybe with some plants in front of it it will look good that's always the way to go um, so yeah, any suggestions regarding the bolt are, like I said, really appreciated. Of course, I also got some comments regarding the fact whether you can uh, download this house. In the end, you will be able to download it, uh, just not the progress. So it will be um, available for download once it's done. But obviously, it's not done yet. But once it is, um, yeah, you'll be able to download it. And um, I think I'll be able to um, yeah, get it up quite soon or at least like two weeks maybe i'm not sure how much i'll be able to upload this but i hope to uh, yeah get this up before i uh, leave my trip which is in a few weeks time uh, well a few weeks actually one and a half week only it really depends on whether the f i will have like whether ea releases another pack which is what i'm expecting um so yeah it really depends on that and i'm not sure whether the release of the pack would mean that I would or whether I would not be able to finish it that soon but I think um, either way I'll do my best to get it done as quickly as I can and I've got incredibly many struggles over there yep alrighty and then maybe well maybe I'm just going to try that to see whether this would look cool just to make it look a little bit better I thought that would be kind of funny there we go mm, that could look cool in the end I think um, let me see, because what would I do that, in what way, I'm not sure what I'm, I don't like that that much, I think it's better if this is the way to go, and then making this a little bit bigger again, yep, and then finishing it off like this, and then maybe we can place like a bar over here, not too sure yet, but something like that would be cool, but I guess we'll do that once we're 
working or starting on the gardening of this house which well, yeah it's quite a big house or at least quite a big lot so it will take some quite some time until I can start the gardening and the gardening itself will take quite some time as well but I expect this will be like in a seven or eight part series because I do really want to build a cool house um, so yeah that simply takes some time but that shouldn't be a problem right um, let me see does that look good or is that too modern because I promised not to make the house too modern so of course then I shouldn't make it too modern let me see whether this works it should work up easily there we go and then that does not look that good unfortunately but that's because that's a little bit different oh what did I do there oh I added the ceiling I believe maybe this makes it look better and then I simply add another fence like this yep there we go in this way it's logically placed but I'm not sure what it looks good in this way um there we go and that's it that could be pretty cool I think yeah I think that that looks cool and maybe I can add like some shrubbery on top of it I think that's something I'll do like I'll kind of preview that for all of you um adding stuff like this wait a second move objects um, there we go well not exactly like this because this does not look that good but you kind of get an impression there um furthermore, yeah i'm not too sure yet whether i'm i feel like this is done but maybe adding this would make it even better and then add this bigger one around it or no that doesn't look good this looks better righty yeah this makes it a little bit more logical i think and then we make this a bit smaller because that would look better and yep then we create this oh wait a second there we go and then also one down here which adds to the modern vibe of this house because still you know it's not going to be too modern simply by making it pretty detailed but still it's going to be a modern build and maybe I'll uh, start another like more traditional let's build as well or simply directly after I finish this one not too sure about that yet um, also don't worry because sometimes when you get like as a youtuber you get feedback and it's not phrased in a nice way or something people immediately feel like they should pr protect like the youtuber which is pretty cool and uh, you know thank you for doing that but don't worry about me it's not that i'm like being harassed by these haters and uh, you know honestly it does not really do that much to me uh, it's just that i realize that i should indeed be a little bit more uh yeah right just simply add some more variety i did not know what i wanted to um yeah phrase the sentence like but um yeah don't worry about it anyways um that's simply what i wanted to say it did not go that smooth but oh well um not too sure whether this looks good so don't worry yet if you're because sometimes you see like i used to watch quite some let's builds as well nowadays i don't watch it many anymore but um yeah back when i watched them i always had like if the youtuber built something which i did not really like i was like oh no don't do that and i do my best not to have too many or add too many of those kind of heart attack moments in the videos or in the letter builds because sometimes you've just got to first destroy something before you can build it up um but oh well um let me see i'm not sure whether this looks good so i'm just going to try that doesn't look good the way it is right now this doesn't look good either maybe this looks good and maybe this works let me see yeah i think i'm 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 trying this could be worse and this is kind of boring maybe on the one hand but it does kind of add to the feel and the vibe of a family house i think so in the end that's what we are building right now here so 
That would be good, I thought. Um, there we go. Can I make this more beautiful? Nope, I cannot. This was the best it could be, or this was the best it could be. Um, yeah, alrighty. Then we've got to finish this off, close this. Can I still do something special there? Because that's kind of boring, obviously. I think I'll make like an entrance. Because, you know, this is more like the back of the house. So you have more windows over here. And it's kind of so the idea of sliding doors. I really want to have sliding doors in The Sims 4. Simply because we had them in The Sims 3. And I believe we do not have them in The Sims 4 yet. And they are really useful. So therefore, I'm kind of missing them. And yeah, I'm kind of trying to create that effect by uh, yeah, creating things like this. Um, which I've obviously, uh, obviously added quite a bit in this house already. Um, so yeah, uh, let me see. How am I going to fix the rest of the house? Because, let me see. We've got this over here, which is not really clear what I want to do with that. Um, Because I'm not adding a flat roof. I want to have kind of a good roof structure for this house. Because, yeah. Roof structures are just really important. But roofing, if you do something that's a little bit more difficult, is kind of hard to do. You know, if you want to do something really simple with a flat roof, that's not that hard. But doing something with an extra roof is always a little bit more challenging. Um, so, yeah, my tip for that. What is my tip? Just, yeah, make it look realistic. Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm not really sure what my tip would be for that. Um, yeah, I believe I did do a shaping tutorial really long ago. Maybe I should start that series again. But yeah, many people like it, but I've not done it in quite some time. So therefore, I'm not really sure what I should start it again. It was like building a house step by step, just building it up from like having nothing. Um, but yeah. For some reason I stopped that series, I believe it was not really being liked a lot by people. But then all of a sudden it turned out that quite some people started looking at it again. And then, yeah, it did get quite some views and comments and appreciation, I guess we could say. Um, but that's a little bit too late. Um, this doesn't work, what am I doing here? Um, Yeah, that's hard. Okay, um, maybe adding a roof like this could work. Let me see. Okay, that's literally not what it's going to be like. Don't worry, but apparently it's going to be kind of kind of hard to get a roof done over there. Um, don't worry about this. I'm in, indeed the leading the main roof structure which kind of shapes the entire house but i'm going to see whether i can kind of remodel that in a better way let me see maybe i should put the house a little bit more towards the right over here because it seems like it's going to be too small for this lot okay it can be a little bit smaller the roof which gives us a little bit more space as well and it can again be a little bit smaller Thing. Not too sure because yeah okay yeah it can because this was stacking out in the other way as well um and it's too much to the right there we go now I think we've practically got the roof back the way we had it but now we've got an extra roof so that's useful and then I thought it would be cool or well I, it's not like I planned this out but I just realized the moment I said I thought that this would look pretty cool if we have something like this there we go now we've got a shape going um there we go that's not that bad and then yeah that could simply end over here and maybe we could add like things which kind of seem like chimneys if i build them like this there we go yeah this could work out. It's not that bad, in my opinion. And then, wait a second, because we're really starting to get going. You know that moment 
when you're like writing an essay and you feel like you're kind of getting into it and you're really knowing what you want to say and everything is phrased nicely. That's kind of the way I feel right now about this house. But it's not an essay, but it's it's not such a boring thing like an essay. Just building a house in the sense. Just so much better. Um, there we go. Whoops. There we go. And then adding those roof. Yeah, siding. So I'm, I'm not sure what I should call those. Um, does that make some make it look a little bit more logical? No, nope, it doesn't. Or at least it does make it look good. This is starting to look better. It shouldn't become too big though. Mm. There we go, because we don't actually need that roof part anymore, I just realized. Um, so let me delete that. Can we? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Um, and maybe I can make that a little bit smaller to make it look better. Well, that does not seem to work. Um, adding some glass. Does that work? might work does not look that terrible actually i think once we start like the wall paintings we can make something really good out of that um oh my game lagged a little bit there that's a long time since it did that um and then maybe this could work as well just to get the shape a little bit better there we go mm. yep that's it. And then, does this look better? Yeah, that does look better from this side, I think. And from the other side, it doesn't matter. Um, by the way, sorry if the commentary sometimes gets silent in this let's build. That's simply what you've got when you do a let's build. You've got to, you know, I know it's Sims and you're simply building something in the game. But still, you've got to kind of concentrate on what you're doing. Uh, and therefore, sometimes it gets kind of silent, but I do my best to just keep talking about whatever I can come up with. Also giving you some information about what I'm building, because in the end, some people like want to get some tips and feedback and just general advice as well. So, got to think about that. Um, there we go, adding this, can I add? I kind of find it frustrating that I can't copy this using this pipette. Is it? The, no, it's not the, it's simply the copying tool. I don't know what the name of it is. But um, yeah, copying for some reason doesn't work uh, with these roof sidings, which kind of sucks. This does not look that bad. I'm kind of happy with it. This is really starting to get some shape. And it might not seem like we did a lot, but we did actually get one entire side of the house done so far. And maybe I can get some shape going over here as well already. Because that would be useful, well useful, but just fun just to make it more exciting to see the next episode. Uh, which I'm not sure yet, but I'll record it right after this. Because I like to get feedback from all of you and implement that feedback. But on the other hand, I'm able to upload a little bit more if I use pre-recording so i've still got to come up with that um let me see i, I do really have the feeling that this is an actual family house for some reason because it's obviously going to be really big but i think you've got to admit that this is not um yeah th this is not like a, a typical modern house right this is actually not yeah it's not really that modern in my opinion, it's it's just a regular house kind of with some modern touches, but that shouldn't matter too much. Only traditional houses isn't that much fun either. Um, delete this and delete that. Um, it could be possible, but I think I don't like it that way. So I think this could fix it, giving it a little bit more space. Um, to get some shape going there. That's not the right one. This should be the right one, I think. There we go. 
And then I'm going to add some counters just to make it look better. And you might wonder, counters, how are you going to add those? Um, well, move objects on is your place you should go then. Let me see, is there a better looking way to do this? Because this is not the most beautiful white I've seen. It's kind of ye yellowish, but maybe this, this one could work out as well. And then, ju then just simply placing these in there. And I see that they're a little bit too tall, which makes it look shitty because then you do actually see that it's a counter. Well, this must stay a secret. So, you know, don't tell anyone. But this does help out to make it look a little bit better. I think, there you go. And now you've got to admit that does not look that terrible. And in this way, you kind of have the constraint floor elevation way of building uh, which we used to have in The Sims 4, uh, 3, I mean. But yeah, I think I'm going to end this episode right here because we're, I think we've made quite some progress. I'm happy, happy with this and I think we'll be able to get the roof done really nicely in this house. So please leave any feedback on the series, what you think of it, what I should do better, in what way the house could look better, just anything. And then I hope to see you back later.